Hey everybody, Dale here, and thank you for watching. When you're all done, if you would click on subscribe and maybe give me a like, I would greatly appreciate that. In this video, I'm going to show you three methods for disabling that blurry background on your Windows sign-in or login screen. In the new Windows 10 1903 edition, they added that for whatever reason. But there are ways to get rid of that so you got a nice, crisp, and clear background. Now the first method is pretty simple. It's just a toggle button in your personalized settings. But this is going to, going to disable all transparency effects across the board, like on your taskbar, start menu, your windows, anything that has a transparency on it. So we're going to right click on our desktop here. You can go to personalize, click on that, or you can just click on your start button down here in the left hand corner. Go to your settings. Then right here we're going to choose personalize. In the left hand column we're going to choose colors. Click on that. And right here where it says transparency effects, you can see it's on, but if we turn it off, uh, you can see right away the transparency effect goes away on everything. So if you want to keep transparency on everything else except that blurry background screen, I'll show you a, a different method. Let's turn that back on. Close this. Now that method will work on all versions of Windows 10, 1903, the Home, the Pro, and the Enterprise. Now the second method is we're going to get into the registry. And to get to the registry editor, editor simply if you got your search box open, just click in there and type in reg, edit. You can see it pops right up here. Just right click on it and run as administrator or again if you don't have this search box enabled just right click on your start button. Go to run and you can type in regedit right there and hit enter. Hit yes, user account control. Now your registry editor opens and up here we're going to navigate through this starting with H key local machine right here. Double click. And double click right here on software. I'll scroll down and find policies. Right here, double click that. And Microsoft. Right here, sorry. And then Windows, double click that. And you're going to look for a key in here called system. Now, and a lot of times it may not be there. If it is there, it's probably empty. So I don't have it. So we're going to add a new key. Very simple. We're going to go up here to back to Windows right here. We're going to right click over to new. Click on key. You can see we're going to clear that out of there. We're just going to simply type in system. Hit enter. Now click it. You can see that it's empty over here. Now we're going to add a new <coughs> value. Right click anywhere in here. Go to new. Down here to D word 32 bit value, click on that. And we're going to name it, we're going to get rid of that. There. You're going to name it Disable Acrylic Background on Login. That's it. Hit enter and double click it. And make sure the value data is set to 1. Click OK. And that's it going to close that out. So that'll take effect right away. You don't even have to restart. Now the third and final method is strictly for Windows 10 Pro and Enterprise. Um, it'll work on home if you got the GP or the group policy ed editor successfully installed. Um, so we're going to open up the group policy editor in Pro or Enterprise. Again, in the search box, you can type in GP edit right here, edit group policy. Or again, just right click on your start button, go to run, and type in gpedit.msc and hit enter. Once this opens, this over here, expand that out a little bit, we're going to double click on administrative templates. I'm sorry, right here under computer configuration, double click administrative templates. And we're going to double click system, scroll down, and find logon. Right here. Click that once. And over in the right hand pane here, we're going to look for this one right here. Show clear background on logon, or show clear logon background. It's not configured, so we're going to double click it. We want to turn that 
on or enable it. Hit apply and OK. And that will take away your blurry background. It's really that simple. So I hope those three methods were helpful, whatever version you have. And as always, I appreciate you watching. And don't forget to subscribe, give me a like, and comments are always welcome. Have a great day.